Dirty News Network, brought to you by Paul and Denno. Proudly putting profit before the truth. You can't handle the truth! Yes, it's time for another edition of the Coyote Network News. There's been some scandals in the news this week. Big news. Big news. Okay, what we're referring to is Gelati Gate. Oof. Now, for those of you who aren't aware of that, this is this is regarding um, a certain hotel in Sydney which was accused of, of serving uh, human excrement in the dessert, in the ice cream. Um, a customer, Jessica White, claims to have taken violently ill after eating a complimentary bowl of ice cream. Um, tiramapu. Tiramapu, was it? Yeah, yeah right. It was... Um, yeah, so basically she said once it, it touched her tongue, she she said it smelt and tasted like human excrement. Because you often get human excrement yeah. that close before you detect That's it, right. don't you? Yeah, yeah, you do. And also they've um, they've asked people... They, they've tested the ice cream container and there was no... Yeah, but that's only the stuff that was in the tubs, that's mate. That's right, yeah. yeah. So they wouldn't... The lady wouldn't give the sample back no. to the hotel to have that tested. No, they took it off for <coughs> independent tests of yeah. their own. But they've also got staff and other people to take... to provide DNA samples because they're concerned that maybe... You know, someone's you know. played a little bit of a gag there. Well, well you know? they're saying it could be a stunt by the hotel. Really? <sighs> I mean... Yeah, you do that for business, <sighs> wouldn't you? They'd spotted it, haven't they? Oh, that, that's that's great, you know. Every, every business wants that kind of news. <laughs> it's great. I mean, just to get that in ice cream, I mean... <laughs> I, Cockroaches are passe. I mean, that's, yeah. that's, that's low-key yeah, stuff Yeah, but, but poo's really going hard. I mean, they've got a few interesting flavours there. They've got the, uh, the poo can nut <laughs> and the uh, poo starchio. I'm, I reckon they're just lucky they didn't order the sticky date. Because, well, who knows? That, I mean, that would have been pretty dodgy. But they, the scandal was further muddled. I mean, this is Australia's mm. journalists have really dug deep on Haven't this. Haven't they? One. Yeah. By revelations that Mr. White's brother in law was marketing manager for Keystone Hospitality, owner of Sydney's cargo bar and bungalow, bungalow eight. eight. Oh. I mean, it's, it's like a mystery murder almost. It like, is. Without the murder. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, you know, when you're getting poo in your ice cream, is this a metaphor for what's going on in the world? You know, should we be looking to the ice cream? Does it symbolise the global economic crisis, you know, when the whole world's gone to shit? Well, well she'd watched The Secret yeah, I a see. number of times. Yeah, right. And I think she created, you know, what she was thinking of. Yeah. But this is this is really... You, you're big on tough journalism like this. I this am. has really inspired you. This has inspired me. It's really... You've been wanting to, to yeah. come out hard on an issue. Yeah, and I'm, and I'm going to. I'm okay. going to in song. So let's... um. We've got a little little track here. You're going to have to turn yourself off too. And um, I haven't got a name for this song yet. Maybe I'll call it Gelati Gate. 